The writer applauds 5G technology for its fast connectivity and its potential advances for human healthcare, transportation, and energy efficiency. However, there are dangers to 5G technology that the writer has failed to consider. The potential risks of 5G must be investigated. First, the writer mentions that 5G will benefit our environment by reducing energy consumption. We might be able to reduce energy waste and lower electricity bills, but how might 5G affect the larger ecosystem as a whole? One study looked at radio frequencies ranging from below 6 gigahertz, which is used in 4G technology, all the way up to 120 gigahertz, which is used in 5G technology. The scientists studied how these frequencies affected insects, including the western honeybee. They concluded that 5G radio frequencies were indeed absorbed by the insects, and over time, this would lead to increased body temperatures and changes in physiology and behavior. What's more, electromagnetic radiation from 4G cell towers has been shown to interfere with the magnetic compass that insects use to migrate. Considering insects are pollinators, we must question how 5G frequencies will negatively affect human food supply and the balance of our ecosystem. In regards to 5G providing safer transportation, the writer overlooks the necessity for a reliable and safe network connection. Networks are still unreliable in rural areas, and so driverless cars, dependent on 5G, would be unsafe in remote places. Far from cities and cell towers, rural roads have stretches known as dead spots where network access is unavailable. Dead spots can change depending on local temperature, humidity, and rainfall. Even when connection to a 5G network is reliable, any device that is connected to the internet, including a smart car, is vulnerable to hacking. A hacker could gain access to any connected information, including a Bluetooth connection from the owner's smartphone. What's more, the hacker can potentially take control of the car's computer systems, increasing the danger of a fatal accident. Finally, the writer is convinced that 5G systems will improve human health care. But many scientists are calling for a moratorium on the installation of 5G networks due to the uncertainty around its effects on human health. Because 5G is so new, there have been no independent studies that have proven its safety. In fact, if we look at the effects of 2G and 3G technology, we can see the very high probability of 5G's harmful effects. In one study, it was concluded that rats' exposure to cell phone radio frequency radiation in the 2G and 3G range over a two-year period resulted in brain and heart tumors. There's further evidence that radio frequency radiation can cause neurological and reproductive harm. In addition to microwaves, 5G's use of millimeter waves means that even with short-term exposure, these millimeter waves can be absorbed within a few millimeters of human skin, and this can negatively affect the immune and cardiovascular systems. Far more research must be conducted to prove 5G is even safe for humans before its use in the healthcare system.